Oh, I once had a chicken who would never lay an egg, so I poured hot water up and down her leg. <laughs> I sang it right for the first time in 50 years. And I didn't. Oh. I. No. The what? little. Oh, oh, I stuck my head no, in no, the no. skunk's hole. That isn't what we were singing. We were singing. Pour that water up and down her leg. Oh, the little chicky, chicky cried. cried and the little chicky, chicky begged. begged. And little chicky laid a hard boiled egg. Er, 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 er. Fly me to the moon. <laughs> My friend Mike howling at the moon. Please enjoy my stories or whatever else might be on my mind today. I think that makes a huge. So tell me again, what is that stuff? It is 3M rubbing compound. Uh huh. And it's what they use on to do uh, uh, paint, you know. Well, it sure make a difference. I don't know if we can tell in the video, but. Look at that one, and then look at this one. Yeah. It should help help this too. Y'all be interested to see if you can do that, and when it's good. Well, I'll give it a shot. <laughs> 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 yeah, the, the stuff's not cheap. It's like like eighty nine dollars for that. Really? But I've had it for years. And I well, we did. This is what we did uh, Bruce's Jeep with. The, ah. the, uh, oh, I remember his red Jeep that we buffed out the paint, the red yeah, paint. That was the same stuff. Oh, yeah. It was so pretty. It was a burgundy color. The neighbor is building a pig pen out of pallets and wire made for reinforcing concrete. That six inch mesh stuff there. He got four little baby pigs that uh, he got put in the pen when it got finished. Well, here we are at another abandoned property. In a trailer, a big satellite dish, a pickup. Some guy's been collecting rocks. This one right here looks like it's got some turquoise in it. Leave it there for the next guy. <laughs> he was a recycler. Clothesline. Bench. Propane tanks. Barbells. Lots of stuff. Uh, the neighbor that we know said this guy passed. Oh, it's locked. Well, lots of stuff. Chicken coop. I'm just gonna look through the window here. I'm not going in there. Hmm. Kitchen 
rainwater. <clears throat> Lots of gopher holes. There's a oh, what the hell was that? Oh, that was Ma uh -huh. Maggie scared me. She just scratched or something, and it just like alerted. It alerted my snake sense. Well, a dream. Everybody's got a dream. This is the back road to Walmart in Kingman, Arizona from Chloride and I just thought that was such a dramatic picture with the sun on the mountains in the background and the shade in the foreground. We like Arizona a lot. Smith and, yes. and then we go, now it's all back roady. Murals are a mile and a quarter. So have you been back here before, Mike? Yeah, I, when Barb and I was here last time, when we had the property, before we met you guys, we had that property on the other side. Uh -huh. And uh, I just, and that's, uh, we came over here to see it. We're on our way about a mile east of Chloride, Arizona to the murals of Roy Purcell. These are some very strange paintings done in 1966 across 2,000 square foot of granite boulders. Images out of the mind of Roy Purcell and who knows what it means. He titled it The Journey, Images from an Inward Search for Self. And uh, I think you'd have to know Roy Purcell to figure out what it all means. He was a somewhat famous artist. He's more, I guess he's more famous because of these. <laughs> but that is a little bit of a downhill. Oh yeah, they didn't think they could get back. Yeah. Yeah, it's where, so many. Where, all set up where are they? They're just around the corner. They, those guys just need to go a few more feet. The, the, up there on those rocks is where the... Uh, they might have parked up there and just uh, yeah, walked walk down here. Yeah, this is like... So where are we going? Right about here. The murals are right there. Oh. But the, up there is the petroglyphs. You can kind of see one right there and one up on top. Does it I'm look like it's going? It's got a little red dot I'm up there? Sure yep. So hey, I made it to Chloride, Arizona, an old silver mining town. We've got petroglyphs yeah. over there and the murals we're, we're, of Roy Purcell up here. Out here. No. Hi, friends. It was so close, I don't know that you're going to like it. Okay, it's going. All you need to do is point it at me and not have the camera in the sun. Come this way a little. There you go. friends, I made it to Chloride, Arizona. It's an old silver mining town. There's petroglyphs up there and the murals of Roy Purcell. Let's go look at some petroglyphs. At this point, it kind of looks like a thunderbird. Who knows? Boy, this is just the wrong time of the day to be doing this. Yeah. The Does the sun shine on it early in the day? So we think this is a goat. Oh yeah, it's got the... It's got the horns One, there. two, three, four legs, head, horns. 
Yeah. Oh, I thought that was and then what do you suppose that is up there? Like a window, me. Looks like a window, yeah. It's probably, uh... Hmm. It looks like somebody shot it. It's, there's bullet holes. Oh, oh, you might be right. So, maybe the, maybe the, uh, Ancients didn't do that. Maybe somebody that likes to shoot out windows just came up here, drew a picture, and then shot it. Yeah, this doesn't look like... I've seen a lot of petroglyphs. I've never seen petroglyphs that look like buildings. Maybe the Indians were saying, Oh, crap, here comes the white guys. They're going to build houses. You're looking for a snake? Go, Mike. You see any more up here? No, I think that's it. Down there, the city of chloride. It's almost holding that rock. This is Mike, our tour guide. Yep. Yeah. Bring you into it. Yeah. Oh. One rock being held up by another rock. A very small rock. Yeah, let's move. And then I'm standing <laughs> next to this big rock. Let's move. It's probably not the safest spot on the hillside. Yeah, no kidding. I'm going to go up this way. Like, don't, get, don't get just in case I bump the rock. Yeah, I bump the rock and it just, just like, got caught by the cat's paw again. Those things are mean. Damn. Get off me. Get off me. Oh. Well, this is a two handed job, and I got one hand already busy with the camera. Braver man. Should I be doing this? No. Uh -huh. No, now I lost my shoe. Oh, no. <laughs> ah, I made it. Well, anyway, I think uh, if I were making petroglyphs, I'd be up here. Nope. Huh. Well, I think I better put the camera away on my way down. What do you think? I would venture to guess that's a good idea. Signs of wild horses, wild donkeys, wild something, huh? Look way up on top, there's a rock balanced. Oh, up there on that. We're going up the hill. Lift? Oh, you're gonna go up the hill? We're going up the hill. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is the worst spot. I when I was up here, you can see that way and it gets the road gets a little Whoa. little better. Trying out this new vehicle, huh? It'll do it. Exactly. It should do it. 
So I've been looking at a lot of YouTube videos about this kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. For instance, I just drove with my wheel over a rock mm -hmm. instead of trying to straddle it because the differential is right in here. And you don't know. You're better off with your tire on the rock than your undercarriage. <laughs> so I'm going to do that again because I didn't have the camera on. <laughs> and then you guys are going to learn a lot about YouTube in here. Okay. Hey, anybody know what those are called? Come on, this is take two. I oh, just okay. told you. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. Hoodoos. Hoodoos, yeah. There. Why do they call them hoodoos? Because uh, who who do it? No, they're like naturally, they piled yeah. up in Zion National Park, but I think people pile them up now and they call them hoodoos because well, from my who do that? My years of being an anthropology major, yeah? they had something to do with the, the, what do they call that? The, oh, where they go out, the, the young guys they go out and here I am filming a senior moment I know it. <laughs> it's really bad uh oh <laughs> here we have the town and the murals and we've got the jeep in four wheel low for the first time Not really necessary right here, but I had two hands in the wheel and wasn't filming when we came through the big rocks. Hey, if you like me, give me one of those thumbs up. And please subscribe and hit that little bell so you know when I post next. Please share me with your friends on social media. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed what was on my mind today.